your residential forms committee would like for you to be aware of a new form that's available to you on forms on the fly. It is RF309 COVID-19 release. It should be on transaction desk and other vendors site within the next few days. I've asked Addison to give you a further explanation of its use and purpose. Addison. Thank you, Jen. As Jen mentioned, um, the residential forms committee voted to release this form to our membership as another tool in the toolbox as we navigate this pandemic. Um, what this form will do is as a realtor, you can have your client sign, um, and this is for sellers, buyers, owners, or tenants. Um, it's to help protect you and also to educate the consumer. Most consumers are aware of the state that the world finds itself in and the dangers associated um, or that may be associated with viewing properties or allowing people into their homes to view their property. This release form is just to sort of reiterate those concerns and those risks to the consumer and to have them sign releasing you, the licensee, from any liability associated with these matters. So for instance, if you have a seller who has their home on the market and they have a potential buyer come in to view the property, um, they could sign this form. And then if they were to contract COVID-19 and were able to somehow relate it back to the viewing of the property, um, you would have this in your file so that they, as a defense, should they try and sue you in court saying, because you had me open up my home, I contracted the virus. Now, obviously, there are no perfect scenarios in this world, but we just want to protect you, our members, as much as possible. Um, so definitely hope that this will be helpful as you navigate this and also to, to make buyers and sellers and landlords and tenants aware of the risk that they come into contact with um, when they put their home on the market or when they're viewing homes for sale. Uh, Tennessee Realtors and NAR does encourage virtual showings whenever possible, but we understand that um, a home inspector can't inspect virtually. So I think that this will be very helpful to our members as we continue to navigate this and the forms committee is continuing to address issues as they arise. If you have any questions, feel free to contact the hotline on it and we're happy to help any way we can. Thanks. Thank you, Addison. We really appreciate you and all the hard work that not only our residential forms committee has done, but the legal staff. So we continue with also supporting our members and we wanna say thank you to all of you and we ask that you please stay safe.